Hey TB family, got a good one for you today. We got a 15 minute AMRAP working on some kettlebell swings, some burpees, and some kettlebell deadlifts. Okay, we'll go through those um, here in a second. Just wanted to say a big shout out to everybody that's being um, super interactive on our Wattify app. Um, loving the likes and the comments, and um, it's just really awesome to see all you guys participating. So keep that up and stay at it. Today, we, are got, we got 15 minutes on the clock. We're knocking out uh, 30 kettlebell swings, 30 burpees, and then 30 kettlebell deadlifts. Okay, if you don't have a kettlebell at home, that's okay. Let's grab that dumbbell we might have or that awkward object such as a backpack. We can still use those things for today's workout as well. Rule number one is in high effect today when we're doing those kettlebell swings. Rule number one, getting our shoulders to be placed down and back behind us. So keep that posture strong as we grab those kettlebells and um, do full American kettlebell swings overhead today. I want to talk a little bit about the burpee today. We got a ton of them and believe it or not, there is a correct way to do a burpee. If you've been in my classes, you know that we emphasize this a lot, but it's literally using the least amount of energy as possible. Okay. Uh, to complete a burpee, I'm just touching my chest and hips to the ground and then standing up and clearing the ground at the top. Very simple movement, but we are not doing a squat, a push-up, and a squat, and then jumping, right? What we're gonna do instead is we are going to reach towards the ground, fall to the floor with our chest using no energy at all, lean back and pull our hips forward as we stand to the top, okay? Falling to the ground using no energy at all, and then using our hips to jump up to that top position uh, without doing an air squat as much as possible. Uh, have fun with this one, guys.